You asked us about apps, and this is my second video showing you Prompt Smart Pro. I like this app because it does a very good job in one specific scenario when you're on your own and you don't want to use a remote controller. It will recognize your voice and it will scroll automatically based on what you're saying and it recognizes it and matches it with the script. Very clever. Let me show you how it works. On my iPad Pro 12.9, I'm going to open the Prompt Smart Pro app. Here it is. And again, import your scripts with the little plus button there. I mentioned in my other video that I don't like to type directly onto the iPad. I find it clunky, so I like to type my scripts up on a keyboard, on a desktop, upload it to Dropbox and import it here. So that's how you do that. In this case, I've already imported my script. We'll go with this one. Let's put the tablet onto the prompted flex and we press the little play button there. Now we want to check that it's oriented mirrored correctly. If it isn't, you want to be pressing the little cogwheel, which is at the bottom, and selecting the mirroring option here. So you've got a whole variety of different options. We're after the mirror vertically, select on. It's the right way, right, right way round, and there we go. So this is now ready. Go to the top. There's a little play button. The little button is swiveled and is on the other side. Oh, before I start. One thing you've got to be sure that you do is that you point the uh, microphones of your tablet towards you, not the other side, because it recognizes your voices uh, on the script through the microphone. So it's got to capture your voice here. So make sure that those are pointing towards you. Let's start. Now I'm going to stand over there. Now Recky's behind the camera is going to tell me when it's ready. Can you see the screen? Beautiful. Hi backers. It's been a week since we did a thank you and we have a load more backers, so it's thank you time. Our backers fall into a few categories. First are our friends, family and colleagues. You have been great support and have jumped in and pledged some amount to help us along. So as you can see here, the text is following my voice and it's quite good, it's very accurate. However, there are a few times that you're going to have to be careful with this. One of them is if there is a lot of sound around and the microphone cannot pick up your voice properly, it won't know what to do. Uh, the script will jump around and it won't be able to recognize. So if you have a very soft voice, or if you're standing further away from the teleprompter and it can't pick up your voice, you're going to get into trouble. The other thing with this that I have found is if you are the type of person, and I am, who likes to ad-lib a little bit. So you go off script every now and then. You add a sentence or you add a paragraph or you add a story which is not on the script, this app will not know what to do. It'll start jumping around trying to figure out where you're at. And then when you come back to your script, you're no longer at the right spot and you're going to be in trouble. So in that case, if you're at Adlibber, don't use this app. I would suggest Teleprompter Premium is probably more suited for you. The other one is if you have duplicate text in your script, and this happened to me earlier on, we had one of our rewards, which is the super smart early bird. And that text was duplicated in the script because I mentioned it a few times. The app, the app started jumping around. It didn't know which one I was talking about. So it went backwards and forwards thinking, oh, he's further along in the script. No, he's not. He's back. So it jumped around and it didn't work for me. So I reverted back to Teleprompter Premium, which worked perfectly with the remote control. You can remote control from a device such as your iPhone or another iPad. You can do it with this app. However, I prefer the teleprompter premium options with that remote controlling. I find it better, uh, just more reliable. However, you can do it. I'm not going to demonstrate it with this app, but I just find it a bit clunky and not as good as the teleprompter premium one. So Prompt Smart Pro, great app if you're on your own and you've got a good voice and it will capture it well. You can scroll automatically. It works well.